I remember myself on and that this time some 41 years ago going into a bookstore in San Francisco and getting one of those books it was the third volume of the first canto I remember reading about Sukadeva Goswami and this is the time of the 60s and Haight-Ashbury and the hippie movement and then and who's the leader? A 16-year-old boy who's naked. <laughs> he's walking around naked. Just He has long hair and he's naked. And when he enters the assembly, the sages give him the presidential seat because they can see by the study of physiognomy that he's not a madman, he's a liberated soul to the extreme. So, and there's a beautiful description of Sukadeva Goswami there. Gurudev used to chant it so many times. He liked it so much that actually some of the words he took from the descriptions of Sukadeva Goswami and used in his uh, uh, compositions and praise of Srila Guru Maharaj. Because it's, he's described as le looking like Shama Sundar Krishna and the beauty of his neck, his body. There's an elaborate description of just how beautiful Sukadeva was. But so, and I'm reading this book. I had some other books at that time, Bhagavad Gita, the other things, but I wanted this. I was always seeing in Bhagavad Gita purport, reference to Srimad Bhagavatam, so I'm reading this. And then it says, Parikit Maharaj asked Sukadev, what is the purpose of one in life specifically for one who is about to die? <clears throat> so the whole book. I'm reading the Sanskrit, the Devanagari, the words for everything I can... <clears throat> and the book leads up to this point. And the king says, What's the purpose of life specifically for one who is about to die? And I'm getting more and more excited. And then it says, Thus end the Bhaktivedanta purports to the first canto of the Srimad Bhagavatam. <laughs> and I thought, No, oh, this isn't fair. <laughs> and I'm like, You're kidding. It doesn't have the answer to the question. I went back to the store and I said, like, do you, you have like the next book? And he said, oh, well, these are used books. And, we, and I said, sir, you have to be kidding. It leads up to this big question. You don't have the next book that answers the question? He's like, you know, don't give me a hard time. I just work here. <laughs> you know? So I realized, that I would have to join <laughs> to get the answer to this all-important question. <laughs> and actually, when I did join, they had just per published the first chapter of the second canto where the question, I said, my dear king, I was saying, thank you, Lord. Your question, what is it, Varyan Eshate Prajna, Loka, Loka, Itam Ripa, Atmavid, something. He says, this question is beneficial for everyone to hear. <laughs>